Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. It's that boy G playing. Don't give a damn. He cooler than the fan. Walking real tall. Some say he's man. We talk at least once a week, though. Mm, okay. And the highlight for me for Swisher House was, of course, for me, still tipping. That was the highlight for me. Of course, I had other records, but when that still tipping record came out, Mike Jones, Powerwall, Slim Thug, that was this. It's on BET every day. It's on Wallace's <laughs> Park every day. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. take us through that time. Like, how did y'all? How did y'all uh, put those? By guys that time, together? man, you know, I'm gonna be honest with you. By that time, I was phasing myself out. You know what I'm saying? That time was, you know, we was growing apart. Yeah. Um. Uh. But the original steel tipping wasn't wasn't them though. Who was the original? The original steel tipping had comedian on it. Um, and I forgot reason why they didn't use it. But by that time, it was Swisher Blast. By that time, it really wasn't Swisher House then. Oh, it Swisher was, House or Swisher Blast. It was Swisher Blast. He like people don't really even realize oh. he, but it was in their face the whole time. Oh, wow. It really was dumb. It really was done. It was it wasn't no Swisher House. Yeah. But you know the logo was there. Why had the logo? So you know, business wise and paperwork wasn't a Swish House. Mm. It wasn't a Swish House during that time. It was Swish a Blast. You know what I'm saying? So and you know I can't get into it deeper than that. Yeah. But it was Swish a Blast. But if you go look on all the records, it says Swish a Blast though. Oh. If you go look on all the records, if you got them, it says Swisher Blast though. Okay. So, but the Swisher House logo, which was the logo for the, you know, it was just such a branded logo mm -hmm. that Watts ran with it. So, you know, it was already branded. So. Now I want to I want to say this too. Um, you you got a lot of mixtape series, but do you? I want to ask you, do you remember this? The Return of the Realest Mixtape. Word up, me and Watts. Back you and back. Watts. Yep. Like, how did y'all put that together? Um, man, we just was like, for like, how did we put it together? We, you know, we did a photo shoot, and you know what I'm saying? We did, that's a real, them real life photos would up me and him back to back like that. Mm -hmm. Um, but it was just really just getting back to just doing some stuff together, coming back because we had went our ways. Parted our ways in 2003 is when I left the Swisher House. Okay. Um, and I forgot when that that was, but whatever that was, that was us just coming back and letting the people know that we, you know, doing mixtapes again together. Mm -hmm. And doing what we doing, just taking some of the, you know, hot records and then taking hot independent artists and doing what we doing. Yeah. Yeah. For sure. Y'all got that, and then you got the After the Capital mixtape series. Oh yeah, them after the capitals and before the capitals was. You know. Let's talk about that, man. Let's talk about that, please, cause I used to, I used to be waiting on like, like we are right, we in Nagish, mm -hmm. so north, in central north Louisiana, Nagish, Shreveport area, Alexandria area, especially Alexandria, like big on Houston. Like we heard a lot of stuff in the south for Master P. Neal, but it was we was we heard Houston first. Yeah. Nah, so Shreveport we used to, was, yeah, cause I used to feed them taste to Shreveport. Right? Yeah. I used to feed them taste to my partner. Uh, they had two stores up there. One was called Cruise and something. Now they had about three stores up there. Cruise and Sounds, I want to say. But I think that that might not. It's Cruise or something. But I remember dude who used to own that. Yeah. And then you had Jabba Jaws yeah. uh, store. And then you had this other little store this dude used to sell in. Uh, he used to sell clothing in the mall. But we used to have the tapes and that, so yeah, them tapes used to bleed on down to Alexandra, and then we had got this one little spot in Alexandra one time. I want to say it used to be a store in Nagages at one time, but it didn't stay up. It probably would. It I didn't stay know. up for a minute. It didn't stay up for a minute, though. Now, I Jabba remember service. You probably didn't. Jabba Jaw still doing this thing, but R.I.P. DJ Pratt the Cat. Yeah, Pratt, yeah. Man, Pratt the Cat. Houston? Yeah, oh my Pratt, God! Yeah, Pratt was our boy. He always fucked with us, man. Yeah. Like, like he—if he'll turn Alexandria into a Houston night. Yeah, Pratt. Like, yeah. like for real, like.